what are true north and magnetic north the sun rises in the east and it sets in west so from that we know what is the actual north what is the true north and what is the true south that is the geographical north which we already know which has been already established that is the geographic north pole that won't change okay that is the true north the actual north true north the globe north the earth north you can call whichever name you want but that is the actual uh, point on the globe you know it because you know that the prime meridian is passing from the greenwich you know the the equate the, the intersection of your uh, prime meridian and equator is passing from ghana you know it but the compass when you actually put the compass it will show the north direction uh, the in a different way it is not the true north it is the earth core magnetic north because earth inside core inside that we have molten element and because of those you know molten element flowing here and there and you know changing and whatever uh, complex things happening this magnetic uh, compass will actually take the magnetic field of the earth so it will show the magnetic pole so it will be north magnetic pole so that will be magnetic north so magnetic north is different from the uh, geographic north pole so true north is a fixed point on the globe we know it we have already fixed it so but the magnetic pole it totally depends on the magnetic field of the earth and which is changing so the magnetic north is the direction that a compass needle points to it as it will align with the earth magnetic field so the compass you have that is the direction showing a uh, say instrument it will show you the magnetic north not the true north see if you see here i am just trying to show how this magnetic north is changing and where it has reached it has it has reached a long distance i am talking about 1600s and now 2022 uh, uh, we are talking about so this magnetic compass is just showing what the earth magnetic field wants it to show and there is an angle between these two true north and uh, magnetic north the difference or the angle between them is called what that angle is called declination so you can call it as 11.5 as you, as i showed you it can be 20 but you know now that the angle i cannot uh, commit it may change so you can say 10 to 10 to 20 so the, you have a you have an angle between your true north and the magnetic north and that is going to be some angle which is around 15 16 you can say and on an average i'm taking so magnetic north pole shifts and changes over time in response to changes in the earth magnetic core as i suggested there is a magnetic core and the magnetic field is what you see in the picture and because of that the alignment is the actual alignment of the compass 